Christus fructus ventris tui. Candlelit procession to Rome's Colosseum is just one of the events to mark this weekend's beatification of Angelo Paoli, a priest of the Order of the Carmelites of the Strict Observance. The 17th century religious will be declared blessed tomorrow in a ceremony in the Cathedral of St. John Lateran, presided over by Pope Benedict XVI's victor for the Diocese of Rome, Cardinal Agostino Vallini. We spoke to the prior general of the Order of the Carmelites of the Strict Observance, Father Fernando Milan Romoral, who explains why he was known as Father Charity. Angelo Paoli was a Carmelite of the 17th, 18th century, and a very, very interesting figure, a very interesting model, not only for the great family of Carmel, but also for the whole church. He was very sensitive regarding poverty, regarding the needs of men and women of his time. He was very sensitive regarding new forms of poverty in, in the Rome of the 17th and 18th century. I think we have to imitate this attitude. We have to be very open to the new forms of poverty we have in our time. We have three main celebrations. The first one will be on Saturday, the 24th. We'll have a big procession uh, with torches, from San Martino ai Monti, the parish and the place where uh, the new blessed lived and died, to the Colosseum, because he was the first one who put the cross on the Colosseum as a sign of uh, devotion to the martyrs who died in this place. The 25th in the morning at 10, we'll have the big uh, celebration, the Mass of Beatification in San Giovanni Laterano, San John of Lateran. And the 27th, that's uh, Tuesday, we'll have the Thanksgiving Mass here in San Martino Aimonti.